fisheries went to, uh, to Korea and to China and looked at um, artificial reefs in those, in those uh, locations where they actually are fish production devices. So in other words, not just aggregating fish, but they create an environment where more and more fish breed and that creates more fish. Uh, and so um, we thought that was something that we would like to do down in, uh, in the southwest of Western Australia, and indeed right around the coast ultimately if, if it works. And so it will be a trial in a sense to start with. We believe very much it's going to work. All the evidence is that they'll you know, do the job we want them to do. Uh, but initially they are under trial and we will have um, uh, a, an organisation of um, independent scientific people uh, who will assess the success or otherwise of these particular uh, off offshore uh, reefs. And so it's, it's a great opportunity in my view for us to use some government resources to give recreational fishers an opportunity to catch more and more fish. We are relying on Korean technology, Korean intellectual property. So the, the moulds that you see here are, are from Korea, but everything else, the concrete, the steel, the work that's been done, the building has all been done by this West Australian company. Uh, and so this, this is giving us a chance to understand technology uh, and whether we develop different, um, different modules, whether we develop different sorts of reefs will be something that we will learn as we go forward. It, it's important that we've got the right technology combined with the capacity of a, of a local business to produce the goods and I think it's a great combination and, uh, and that's why they got it because it was considered by the tender panel to be far and away the most um, the, the, the best proposition that we could have. We want them to last a long time in the ocean so you've got to have top quality uh, product and that, that's what we believe we have. Uh, Rec Fish West and the recreational fishing community of the South West are indeed really excited about this project. It represents a co-investment of money from the royalties for regions and also a large quantity over half a million dollars of recreational fishing licence money and that demonstrates right here behind me a real tangible benefit and a return to those in the community who buy and purchase uh, recreational fishing licences. Well essentially this will improve recreational fishing experiences in the Greater Geograph Bay region. It provides another form of, of fishing, it provides other opportunities that perhaps aren't available to those with, with small boats. Um, we have a growing population in the southwest. Geograph Bay represents a beautiful, calm, sheltered, family friendly fishing waters. Uh, it's very popular and it's very popular for tourism as well and we're really hoping that these will provide a large benefit not just to the southwest but also to those people that come here to visit.